Looking for where to catch up on the biggest happenings of the week from across the country? Paul's Weekly Recap has got you covered. I am La Yemi Fearless. Let's get to it, shall we? Highlights from Week 5 of BB Niger Season 7 As the fifth week of the season comes to an end, let's take a look at some of the biggest highlights that got fans talking. Chomzi emerged as the first female head of house of the season. The two levels finally merged into one house. Chi Chi and Diana got into a heated argument on Sunday night after Chi Chi found out Deji and Diana were sharing the same locker. This led to Chi Chi getting a stern warning and punishment from Big Brother. Shags and Fina had a go at each other during the wager task preparations. Bella and Shags were issued a stern warning from Big Brother over their attitude towards tasks in the house. Deji left his shippers in a pool of tears after admitting that he could no longer hold his end of the romance with Chi Chi. Stick with us for more drama field highlights from the BB Ninja Level Up season. Burna Boy engaged in a face-off with Wizkid FC. The Nigerian social media space was abuzz with reactions on Tuesday, August 23, 2022, following a face-off between Grammy Award-winning artist Burna Boy and the fans of Wizkid. It all began from a tweet from a frontline member of the Wizkid FC identified as Mr. Underscore MD, claiming that the tickets for Burna Boy's UK show sold for $14, with an additional CD as an incentive. According to him, the ticket price and the CD was a ploy by Burner Boy to get a number one album in the UK. In a series of tweets, Burner Boy replied to Whiskey FC describing them as delusional and asking that they desist from peddling falsehoods about him. <laughs> Street Hop singer Portable bagged the Chief Tennessee title in Ugo State. On Monday, August 22, 2022, controversial Street Hop artist Portable posted clips from his coronation ceremony as the Amuludu of Tigbo in Awodi land of Ugo State. The title Amuludu, a Yoruba phrase that translates to one who makes the community happy, was conferred on the Zazu Ze Kruna by the Unitigbo of Tigbo Ilu land. Portable will now be addressed as Chief Amuludu of Tigbo Awori land. This development came only a few weeks after he was disqualified from the Hedis 2022 over his alleged involvement in criminal activities. Buju Benson and Ruga were at loggerheads on Twitter. Nigerian music stars Buju Benson and Ruga engaged in what appeared to be a supremacy battle on Thursday, August 25, 2022. The second round of their beef was reignited following Benson's tweet where he threw shade at Ruga while sharing a link to his new project, Bad Since 97. The tweet escalated into both artists body shaming and throwing insults at each other. It would be recalled that Ruga and Benson had a public spat in July 2022 after Ruga claimed that he was a bigger star than Benson when replying to a fan. Ruga also insisted that unlike him, Benson cannot boast of solo hits. Thank you for your love and your support. I really appreciate you. Veteran rapper Idris Abdukarim underwent a successful surgery. Nigerian veteran rapper Idris Abdukarim has successfully undergone kidney transplant surgery. In a statement released via his Instagram page on July 6, 2022, the music star publicly said that he was suffering from a kidney ailment that required surgery, which made the veteran rapper solicit support from well meaning Nigerians to fund his kidney transplant surgery. It has been revealed that both the rapper and his wife, who was the donor are recuperating, thanking Nigerians for their support and asking that prayers be sustained as they recuperate. We wish him a speedy recovery. Yeah, yeah, we are all together. Yeah, yeah, we are all Police Commission Union declared an indefinite strike. The Joint Union Congress of the Police Service Commission (PSC) issued a notice of indefinite strike to the management of the commission over a breach of the agreement. The union stated in the notice that the strike will commence with effect from Monday, August 29. 
29, 2022. The strike action was conceived amid the ongoing disagreement involving the staff of the commission, the chairman of the commission, Mr. Musilu Smith, and the inspector general of the police, Usman Al-Kali Baba. The bone of disagreement revolved around whose responsibility it is to recruit, promote, and appoint constables and officers. And it's a wrap, guys. Don't stop viewing, liking, and sharing our content. Until next time, bye.